the voices of these women reverberating through the halls of the Hamilton County Courthouse on behalf of these women, women who've lost their lives to domestic violence, women whose voices can't be heard. We remember them. We remember them because they no longer have a voice on earth. Remembering with each step as they march around the courthouse. Domestic violence wasn't something Jared Stroop thought much about until last September. That's when his sister, Rachel Madden, was killed at the Adams County Lumber Company where she worked by her estranged husband, who then turned the gun on himself. I won't say that I thought they were going to stay married forever, but I didn't think that this type of situation would ever happen. Um, I never pegged him for that type. Madden was going to divorce her husband and had recently taken out a civil protection order against him, a protection order Stroop says ultimately had little effect. My sister was told by police that they didn't have the resources to come out and help her when the restraining order was broken. That's a problem in my opinion. That's something that needs to change. Along with reflecting on the lives lost, tonight was also a night to celebrate the victories. Just this year, strangulation became a felony in Ohio. With the policy changes that have happened every single year, those numbers of murdered victims uh, tends to go down. Hey there, thanks so much for visiting the Local 12 YouTube channel. Click the links, hit subscribe to get notified anytime we post content to this channel.